there is a hugely hidden crisis in Ireland, and that's the crisis that is happening in the eviction courts in around the country every single day. Today alone, there were 177 families in the eviction in seven eviction courts around the country. I was at Tullamore Court where there were 29 families. Last Monday a week, there were 696 families facing the eviction courts just in one day. And that's not just, it doesn't happen just on a Monday. So, it happens so Ken, every you, single week. Are you saying then, Ken, if we had a government in place, that this, something might be done about this or things might change? These people mm -hmm. are not talking about the eviction crisis whatsoever. Yes, they will talk about homelessness, but I know the two things lead to the one, but these people, where are these people that are being thrown out of their homes supposed to go? This government are not talking about alleviating this problem at all. For instance, I... So I what, 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 what can happen with the political situation as it is to help those people? You see, what these people must do, the government, the, the TDs must get together and they must force the banks into finding a fair and sustainable solution for mortgage holders. Now, at that meeting last Saturday, I invited 155, 58 TDs. 12 of them bothered to reply and four turned up at that meeting. I haven't heard from the others. But we okay. do have another meeting on the, on the 30th of, of April and we'll be uh, inviting every one of them there again to see if they just care about what's happening okay. on eviction. There must be yeah. a moratorium but while the banks are forced into uh, yeah. engaging with people. It's the banks that are not engaging. It's not people. The banks will tell you that people are not. Okay. But it's the yeah. banks but, that are but, not but, engaging. But